Good morning. It's 0639 minutes. It's the 24th of April, 2021. <clears throat> it's probably in the 40s somewhere. and be low 40s. You know, I seen a video of them dandelions opening up yesterday. That was pretty cool. Especially when the seeds come. That's pretty cool. Man, I fell asleep so early yesterday. I was out cold by like uh, like 20, 20 hundred hours, 2,000 hours. Oh, man, we got some modulation up here this morning. Some modulated cloud cover. morning how'd you sleep last night oh here she comes there she is oh she's big this morning Oh, I got red to the south and to the north. What's in the middle? Oh, the hysteresis has arrived. Oh, we want to royal boys and girls. Hey, Russia, leave me in a fuck alone. I'm busy right now. Oh, look at the fucking radiant energy. Oh, the torsion, huh? Oh, yeah, that's what that is, huh? Oh, I bet you it is. <laughs> oh, man, that's... That's like a fucking moray pattern of fucking circular magnetism. Holy shit! It's just exploding up there. It's going right through the green and red, too. All the way down to the ground. Hey, baby, how you been? Oh, well, at least you got your mask around your chin. Oh, here comes the ultraviolet. Oh man, she's freaking toroidal this morning. She's just spinning and happy to see me. <laughs> oh man, that's a sight. That is a sight. It's turning red or white though. It's turning white. Good morning. Oh yeah, give me that pyramid in my, in my, uh, show me that pyramidal shit. In my mind, I can see a pyramid. You know what, my friend, I don't think I'm going to take pictures of my face no more. I want to quit teasing you after the little stunt you pulled yesterday on me. I see how you are. 
You got jokes too, huh? <laughs> Let the Ricky games begin. <laughs> you see the modulation? Some in that direction, some in that direction there. Hey you, what the hell you doing up here? Hey, my friend. <clears throat> I found a, uh, a lottery ticket yesterday. Wonder if I won. The real question is, what would I do with that money if I did win? I know one thing, I have a lot of friends that I didn't know I have. <laughs> Got a note. <coughs> I'm not bending over to read that shit. Wow, this apple's so good. I called it an apple crisp the other day on the video. I meant to say honey crisp. <laughs> Jeez, I was stressing yesterday. Went for a walk or like around uh, 1300. And I thought I, I lost my phone. <clears throat> I left it at the house. Yeah, a bunch of strange shit happened yesterday. Oh yeah, I just watched a video of, uh, what was it about? Mr. Musk, you were talking about, uh, the climate change and the children asking you, well, why didn't you do anything? You, why didn't you know? Da -da -da -da. Mr. Musk. They've been freaking doing this stuff since before my grandfather was born. Before global warming was ever invented. So by now, you know, they should, uh, the problem should be solved by now. You know, I can't get it through people's heads that the, the, the biology of everything's changing. You know, they, it, it just like, oh, this is, you're, we're, we're living in another dimension as I'm talking. Like, I can't, I can't get over it. It's like, it's like talking to a fucking wall. That actually can speak back to you in 
All it wants to do is look into another dimension called Facebook. Holy shit. And I've actually been having uh, a lot of stress lately, neurologically. For some reason, my brain doesn't want to up, keep uptaking this shit. It wants to wander somewhere else. That is weird, though. You could, like, study something for, like, a year, and all of a sudden... Like, if you don't have that super passion for it, I'm talking about myself. Um, yeah, if you're not that super passionate about it and just uh, go into deep learning about it, sometimes when you take a break and you come back to it, when I come back to it, even if it's uh, six months down the road or a year down the road, for some reason... Uh, I get a, a like a double take of it, like I'm getting another dimension of the of the process. It's pretty strange how it works. Sometimes I do have to take a break for some reason. I don't know why. I have to walk away and come back to it. I hate that. Where are you yelling at me? I'm bird. Ah. Here the woodpecker. Pecker of the wood. The wind's actually blowing northeast. More north than east. There's no wind down here. So about... That elevation right there, that's probably what, an extra, hmm, kind of hard to judge from on the bottom of the hill. Our flagpole's got to be at least 60 foot long. Um, how plumb am I right now? We're going up at like a good 40 degree angle here. No. Down there, that's a... Uh, that's about a hundred and... 200 feet up. Plus 60, 260 up. Almost 100 yards higher than I am. And, uh... I don't know how I just made that calculation, but... I think it's pretty accurate. So that flag's blowing at about... what I say? About 300 yards? Or 100 yards? I can't remember what I said. I'm going to have to watch it. Because that is about 200 yards away to the flag. It's just a hell of a, an incline here to get to the top of the hill. So it's like 125 thousandths of a mile. I've been forgetting my notepad recently, too. Not today.
Jing Ming and Father Frank. If Father Frank's still there. I wonder if they got a pool table in that place. <laughs> That's why pool is such a fun game. Because you look at balls and racks all night. <laughs> Uh, wind stop blowing whenever I get here, huh? All right, we're gonna go get in the cover. <sighs> here are the blue jays. Yeah. Ah! That's all they can do. I thought, I thought they could do something else, but they can't. That's some little woodpecker birds that I hear that go, ha, ah, ah, ah. ha, Hey! Oh yeah, I was doing some thinking. I've seen someone on a military talking about how they don't regret going to the military to that and the third. They learned some critical training for uh, my magnifier. They learned great critical training and, uh, you know, they don't regret it. That makes me think, why isn't that shit taught right there? You know, why Why do they make them sit in the fucking building all day wearing diapers on their face in plexiglass, surrounded by armed fucking tasered guards? Instead of taking them outside. And teach them what the military teaches to stay alive. Without the twist of killing. I was just wondering. Especially those that don't have the the passion to be there, and it seems like they're struggling and whatnot. They don't need to be there. Those that are excelling, moving forward. Especially those that excel with the numbers and stuff and writing, and they want to keep learning it. That that would. Bring a higher institutional learning, in my opinion. Um, competition's a good thing, but uh, you need very well versatile people that aren't scared of their own skin, aren't trying to kill themselves whenever they wake up in the morning. My friend, you better take note of that. And then whenever you get to high school, it's just like, oh, I just want to look at bra straps and panties all day long. No shit. I could care less what the hell that what was coming out of that teacher's mouth whenever it is. I could smell hormones. I'm sorry. Fuck, I go out in the shower the other day. And I'm just like this. I keep smelling myself. I couldn't stop smelling myself. Because I don't wear deodorant and shit. I love fucking, fucking smelling myself. I don't know why. I'm a fucking weirdo, I know. It smells fucking sweet, man. 
all the apple juice. <laughs> All right, how long this video been, my friend? Oh, shit. Mr. Clinton, uh, he must have won out for the weekend. Because <laughs> there's no one home down there. Holy shit, man, I make a 20 minute long video, that's insane. Insane, new word, insane. <laughs> Alright, whenever I get to my destination, I'm gonna, uh, 